Right. So how does the far right feel about this story? Uh-huh. Diane Luch, Luch, pretty much just sums it up. So does this change anything? I, I mean, do you want my opinion? Are you listening? Not a damn thing. How many times have I said four very important words? These four words. Winning is a virtue. So they're telling you. Tracy, they're telling you. Don't care. We don't care. He's still it. We don't care. We still want him. We don't care. Even if it's found out true, which it is true, we don't care. Just win. That's it. They want control of the Senate. Blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. Blah, blah, blah. And he owned a business that employed via 300 people. JFC, the show, is it long enough to list out just for cho, just for checking. Just, I don't know what that JFC stands for. Yeah, what is JFC? The show. Um, Jesus effing. Oh, <laughs> okay. nah, yeah, I probably would never ever use that. Phrase, I would have never got me. that. And thank you for putting JFC because even I wouldn't go that far. But yeah, there's not a show on on YouTube. That's not a show on national television. I mean, who's worse? The FBI. I mean, his lies are Trump's lies. The right doesn't. I mean, nobody Mm -hmm. had to tell. Hey, Susan, nobody had to tell me they didn't care when they elected Trump and he said Mexico isn't sending its best people. They're like, oh, well, we won. So, so what? And send all the Muslims back. Okay, fine. And if I had to tell you far left people what again, again, because this came up recently, Puerto Rico is you mean a far part right. of the United States. You mean far right, because nobody far on the right. left. Yeah. Puerto Rico is a part of the United States. They do not need a green card to come into the United States because they are in the United States. They don't need a green card because they have social security numbers because they are part of the United States. They're just not a state for some odd reason. Just like Washington, because apparently their garbage collection is not big enough. Something they They don't have car lots. That's what Holly said. They didn't have car lots. More from Lil Dana. What I'm about to say is in no means a contradiction or a compromise of a principle. And please keep in mind that I am concerned about one thing and one thing only at this point. So I don't care if Herschel Walker paid to abort endangered baby eagles. I want control of the Senate. If the Daily Beast story is true, you're telling me Walker used his money to reportedly pay some skank for an abortion and Warnock wants to use all of our monies to pay a whole bunch of skanks for abortions. Lord, I went to church today and I'm not really trying to say it. Today. I'm really not trying to, but she gonna, she, and you go, because I think you go, you go say what I'm thinking. I'm like, oh, no. What, what did she just say? How dare you? Compromise all of our supposed positions. We don't care. We only care about winning. They've been all but saying it for how long now? So now they're just saying it out loud. But she she, she made three, I had three problems with her statement. One, she, who is she to call anybody a skank? I guess it takes a skank to no one. Mm-hmm. See, I shouldn't have did that. That was wrong. That was wrong. That was wrong. 
But she she knows what the Hyde Amendment is. The Hyde Amendment for the right is the bill that prohibits the federal government from paying for abortions. So even if Warnock wanted to pay for abortions, he couldn't pay for abortions because the Hyde Amendment exists. But her dumb audience is going to be like, yep, that's what we wants to do, pay for abortions. Uh, look at here, Rocky, Rocky Moore and Bullwinkle. I can't take no more of y'all. I cannot take no more of y'all. Y'all, y'all really, y'all trying my patience. And one day, I'm just going to get on here and just start on a profanity-based lace and just go. And then I'm, I'm just going to get tired of it because they y'all making me sick. How is she going to call somebody a skank? He paid the skank. Oh, so now she's a skank. Well, that makes her Walker a skank. He slept with her. So it takes... Here's the deal, that, um, Dino. Dino. Idiot. Doesn't matter. First of all, this is in no way, shape, or form a compromise or a sub to that effect. Yes, you are. It's the equivalent of you. I always told uh, people when you say a sentence and then use the word, but it's automatically going to mean that you're going to contradict what you just said. 99 out of 10 out of a hundred, you're going to contradict your first sentence. So when you literally said this is in no way, shape, or form is a compromise or take it away from what we feel, and sure enough, you went and compromised <laughs> and went exactly against everything that you have been preaching word for word. You sit on a pedestal of saying abortion is wrong. It should be illegal. We should have the right to tell a woman what to do. And then the next sentence you went, basically, unless a candidate that we have chosen to be a part of their life and we just want the sentence so bad, we're willing to compromise our beliefs simply because we want to win. That's what you're saying. <laughs> Well, she said it. No, I know. Yeah, she said, That's I don't I mean. care. I want you to stop with this whole, but we're not, but because the reason I'm saying it, Tracy, is because I guarantee you this her or somebody like her is going to come back the next day, pretend that they never said that and go right back to abortion bad. You shouldn't be. They're just going to pretend like none of what they said means absolutely nothing because they're going to push back on, I mean, they're going to use, not push back, they're going to use, but we didn't compromise our convictions for what we said. We're just saying that we want to win so bad that eh, what we have been preaching for so long for what we want everybody else to do, we're willing to pretend that is not that big of a deal. But the thing is, Marlon, Herschel Walker isn't the only one. There's a um, representative in Tennessee that paid for not only just his mistress to have an abortion, but his wife. You, and, and got reelected. Got reelected, no problem. I mean... If we looked into the personal lives of all of our politicians, we would find most of the behavior that they are screaming about is simply projection. All of it is. Yeah. Don't look. So, and here's the projection. Don't look at what Herschel Walker did. You need to look at the women that he did it to. They're the real issue. No, they're the skanks, Marlon. They're the skanks. No, I, oh, I know, because this is no different than, well, boys will be boys. Well, she shouldn't have wore what she wore. It was well, like a room talk. He told her to walk yeah. down the street by herself. Well, you shouldn't have talked to her. Well, she turned them on. Well, she looked at them. 
It's, it's, it's projection. You're still basing it off the fact that we got the world's greatest puppet that we can control. So I need to take the projection off of Walker and put it <laughs> on the women, a.k.a. the skanks. Which, by the way, really, really nice of you, you Christian. That's yeah. really a great way to project Jesus and his love for the world by calling absolutely anybody a skank. You're a bunch of hypocrites. You always have been. You probably always will be. That's but, it. But Marlon, here's the thing we're missing. They're winning. That's the pro This side is winning. What's up, Parker? Hey, Parker. Same Parker. <laughs> I, I, I got him on the background. too. Okay. Yeah. Oh, good lord. I, I honestly don't care who wins that game. Tracy's dead. Thank you. Scott DeGeris. Yes, he paid his wife and for two abortions, and his mistress had one. Did ask why he responded at the. Was he the doctor that was sleeping with one of his pa one of his patients and he made her have an abortion, or was that the other one? Who keeps sleeping with these people? Why is who is keep sleeping with these guys? <laughs> yeah, and you look at me like not to be judgmental because you're not supposed to judge people by their appearance. But really, like if I'm gonna do, nah, it's a no for me. Hey, Susan, I can answer their question. They're protecting oh. our children from fentanyl that the the illegals are going to give out for Halloween. That that's their latest conspiracy theory. Yes, that's what that's. <laughs> yes, group of Trump supporters. She literally said they're giving away oh, fentanyl. <laughs> So everybody that's... <laughs> she said where the man is. I'm like, well, I know where they at. Protecting our children from all the fentanyl that's going to be given out at Halloween. Okay, so I'm for like... everybody who's kind of confused, um, mm -hmm. here's the question. Have a very important question. Why is bit... What is bit weed? Thinking about it must have a function. This is a political question. And say it again, Tracy. I said that the MAGA people, because I was answering her last question, not this one, they uh -oh. were protecting children from the fentanyl that's going to be distributed by illegals during the Halloween season. They literally said that. But they're winning. I'm losing brains. How I'm are losing. we losing to these people? So, something wrong with us. It's not that it's us because we putting up with this crap. And I'm like, dang on it, I'm tired of it. Because we don't gerrymander, because and well we do, but we don't do it enough. Yeah, we will. We will. After we look at twenty twenty four, we'll they'll get their crap.